it somehow might be that time. Somehow. The time has come once again. This really shouldn't ever be attempted. This is a sickening thing to even look at with your two eyes. Two years ago. Hell was there. We were all witnessing what it was like. 99. Jacob de Grom was the definition of absolute misery. There was no picture I've ever seen in my entire life that has been more scary, that has been more fierce, that has been more intimidating than this guy. By the way, this game was amazing. I am going to be using Jacob de Grom today, and this is not going to be in 23. I'm going back two years for this. Jacob de Grom has been nerfed big time he has been completely nerfed in the newer games i think since 21 they just simply have not made pitchers this dominant maybe randy johnson but i still degrom is way scarier nothing makes my blood bubble with extra sensitive soap like seeing the lineup screen for this game this was immaculate every single part of it there's so many amazing players that were in this game i'm a little bit mad at myself because i'm going to enjoy every minute of this probably and the person i play is probably going to be very pissed off i'm assuming that somebody playing this game that's two years old is not coming on this game to what is not playing this game to try and face the grom that's just why bother so i apologize in advance but shorter to find a game in 19 wonder why that is I'm sorry, buddy. Actually, this might be miserable for both sides. If you wanted to get carved up and look absolutely pathetic on the f***ing field, this was the game you'd play. This is like All-Star, and it feels like easily Hall of Fame. That's a bad play. That's one of those ones you get thrown on the bench and yelled at in front of your mother. Uh, he's having a rough time. Where's Vlad going? What? If this gets down, I'm going to be sick. That was the weirdest hit of all time. It was so strange, I can't even fathom that, actually. Babe pretty much put his thumb out. And it ricocheted off of it into right field. God, every default view is awful. You know, the unfortunate thing about this is that there is a chance I get destroyed. And this would really defeat the purpose of everything. Oh, no. Oh, God. This is f***ing crazy. Every damn game you go back on, you just struggle at it. That's, that's what happened. Pretty much consistently what you witnessed in this was just, he's going. I can't make a throw. He's, he's not even trying now. He's given up hope because he's scared, I think. Oh my god, stop messing up! Did he quit? You pitch one game, and then the next time you take the mound, you're pretty much in the emergency room asking where the mashed potatoes are. Still don't know how that makes any sense. I don't know if I'll even be able to play more than one inning. This connection is terrible. It's so bad, I might actually legitimately think I'm connected to the Wi-Fi router at Home Depot. When does he go? He steals now. Babe? Get it, buddy! hell is going on mother of shit i don't know if there was really a pitcher in this game but after july that was not insanely hard to hit just like the fifth game i'm trying to enter
I have a hemorrhoid growing out of my right ear at this point. The Grom has no f***ing stamina now. None. Not even like an ounce. He's the most useless person on the baseball field at this moment. He's like a walnut on top of a sewing machine. He's bunting. He's not bunting. If he swings, it might leak. If there is... Oh, he, now he's... What? That's inaccurate then because it said there was nothing. I think if there was any pitcher living... Jacob DeGrom is the only pitcher in MLB The Show's existence who can pitch... ...on no stamina. This man saw death coming for his face and just ignored it. So he decided to start a closer. Probably didn't need to be dived at. Come on, baby, a bucket of buttered shrimp. What's going on here? This one's leaving, isn't it? How's the ball trail on? This is insane that this is legitimately on All-Star, I think, at the moment. It is gone and it might not come back. Babe Ruth giving a jumping arm high five is something I never thought I'd see. That is, that is destroyed. Christian Yelich in every single game. He's making me talk like a stupid idiot. Did I decide to play the best I've ever played on a two-year-old game? No. He's using Wander Franco. That's unfortunate. So is a bunt going to happen in 90% of these at-bats? I don't know if he knows that his energy has been gone since the first inning. I don't know if it matters. Wasn't this the problem with this game, in a way? You could have no stamina, but you're still throwing 102 every time. No, oh, thank you. He's pitching until he's legitimately a useless human being. If you can bat 077 with the pitcher, that is probably like 400 with anybody else. This might not even be a useless at bat here. Sit down and shut your ass up. Does Mickey care? Mickey gives a shit. I think this just sums up the entirety of Jacob deGrom's existence. Nobody wants to face him. Went right through his shoe. You know what the best part about this game is? I actually know who's coming to the plate. If you don't look at the person coming up in 23, you might not know who it is. Wow, Tatis is amazing here. So he has all the runs, I think? What was that? That was like a screwball fastball. A screw-ass ball. That's what it was. A what ball? Let's try to name that something else. Pitches are bleeding in the air. The rum's broken. RC from Toy Story on the mound. He's a broken mess. Oh my god. The ball trail actually looked kind of cool on that one. This is insane. He's just, what's the, what's the plan here? Plan is to bring everybody in out of the bullpen every inning. I don't know if a human being has been less capable of doing anything than hitting the pitch speeds in this game. All right, DeGrom, it's pretty much obvious what's happening. 
He's still impossible. In fact, this guy has resorted to bunting for 90% of this game because he's completely given up. I think everyone I've played has somewhat given up knowing that DeGrom is pitching. I respect it. All right, that'll be it. The point of this was to pitch with DeGrom and somehow that happened. Everyone just gave up. That's what happened. Everybody didn't want to play. So that's that's where we're at. DeGrom is still, it's still annoying. That's what it is. And to be honest, I, I believe it and I agree. And that's probably the most sickening thing ever, actually, that I decided to do this. Again, I apologize.